Hey guys, welcome back to yet another video of the China Let's Play. This is episode 3. Unfortunately, I didn't upload yesterday because, well, we didn't have internet for some reason. Uh, there was some maintenance at the time I was meant to record, so, you know, I went to sleep right after. I was meant to go to sleep right after, so I really couldn't wait for hours for them to fix it and turn, you know, it turned out that I couldn't really make that video, unfortunately, so... I didn't really do anything else since then and uh, well we'll be doing basically day 3 right now. Anyway, Japan didn't respond to our demand, we have a lot of forces ready on their border. Count that this is like day 1, this is like day 1 forces we have on the border and they're still pretty significant. And yeah, you can see that we have some front ports, a bit of industrialization, some more building of units as you can see, some research. And what? No, let's get level 2 infantry, that's gonna be useful in the near future. And um, let's also get level 2 light tanks. I'm gonna continue industrializing our country, well that's already happening honestly, so we have level 3 over here. So we have some pretty damn good production actually. Uh, good production has went up significantly by like 5000, which is a pretty insane amount. Anyway, let's clear war and uh, see what happens. We'll really just walk in here, they might have some units, but we'll be able to take them out, I have no doubt. Uh, they have this here, I'm gonna go fight that. And we're gonna just try to take everything that Japan has in China. Of course, it's gonna be hard to take Haikao over here, over here I mean uh, Hainan. Because I know they have like a cruiser here and it can definitely destroy my units when they uh, disembark to take that land. It will probably happen. So we're uh, gonna have to keep that in mind. I'm gonna take a couple of these interceptors and take this out. Uh, let's take four. I mean we can attack with all of them honestly. Yeah, let's do that. Let's attack with all of them. That's gonna be the smartest idea. And with our units, I'm just gonna walk to Shanghai over here. Really, this should be no problem. They shouldn't have a navy on the east coast over here. They usually don't. They usually have it near Japan and uh, near Taiwan and uh, over here just a little bit. And that's about it, so yeah, we should be fine. They have enough units to really just bully them with uh, even our artillery, so we'll use that advantage. We have some light tanks too, uh, we'll be able to actually just walk through here uh, without a problem. I think this is gonna be an easy victory, actually, surprisingly enough. So let's just walk through, uh, take Beijing and whatnot. We're just gonna try to take, you know, all of their, all of their land in China. But yeah, this should be an easy victory, so uh, take all of these, uh, take this city, and then we can go all the way to here. That will actually attack Communist China, we don't want that, not yet. We will take them out a bit later. Gonna take some of the reinforcements we made that, you know, secure basically all of this. We can send them to the east. So yeah, there we go. And that should be easy, so we're gonna take Japan out of China, I'm gonna try to take Taiwan too. Uh, then we're gonna attack Communist China, and after probably Manchukuo, and maybe take Korea too, or probably we will. We might want to build a navy too to actually defend our coasts against Japan later on, and secure our gains, of course. After we'll probably move into Tibet, Xinjiang, Mongolia, probably Tanatua, uh, maybe into the south. I actually don't really have a goal for this let's play. Maybe we'll just try to dominate Asia. Maybe take. Uh, in the China too and India and uh, probably even maybe even the Soviet Union and whatnot. Maybe try to take all of Asia or something. <laughs> By the way, uh, the UK is completely losing against Ireland. Like goddamn. I don't think I ever saw that bad a loss in that war. Ireland is pretty damn tough, but uh, they really landed in Scotland and already almost uh, have Edinburgh and out then they own out of Scotland, so yeah. So I'm not gonna industrialize anymore right now, I guess we could uh, build some more units. So let's do that, so these three, we're just gonna build some light tanks here and schedule as many as we can of course as well. Then of course build some artillery as well, let's actually build the level 2 ordnance factories too. Ordnance foundries, my bad. And the rest can build infantry of course, that's gonna be the best unit to build. Anyway, that's it for this, that's gonna be out of production, we already have like 80 units though, so that's quite a lot. At the end of day 1 we had like 60, 63, now we have 82, and we're only gonna get a lot more 
uh, right now. Not gonna produce anything in Wuhan, we don't really need more planes, not yet at least. I mean, we have 11 already, they're level 1, but we can upgrade them and you know, uh, we won't really need much more for Japan or maybe not even anymore. So that's it for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys with another one tomorrow. See ya then!